Yeah, can you see him? Yep. On the slides? Yes. Perfect. Thank you very much. Okay. Well, today I'm going to present a uh, question about uh, my admirable designer, Philip Stark. Well, this is Philip Stark, and he's a French designer who works for fields of uh, industrial and interior design. And he was born in France, 1949. And he got famous uh, for designing uh, Elysée Palace. Uh, when François became president, he designed uh, his residence uh, province, province of the president in Elysée Palace. Uh, before I start this uh, interior part, uh, this, this characteristic is uh, using antique styles and uh, modern and sophisticated designs combining together. Uh, it's, and it makes the Philip Stark's design style. Uh, this is a, a mama shelter uh, in Paris, France. Well, as you can see, the ceiling uh, there's 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 a weird <laughs> doodling on a ceiling, which is a uh, which shows like Philip Stark's humorous design art, and the lights, it's just kind of modern. But uh, when you see the like chairs and other furniture, uh, it's very antique. Used by using woods, it shows more antique styles. And, but overall, it doesn't look very old. But it's very stylish. Uh, it's called uh, Le Maurice in Paris also. Uh, when you see the ceiling, uh, he used very unique painting to express the antique. And it looks almost like a Greek temple. But when you see the, the tables, it's very modern. Uh, on the other hand, like the, the previous one, it's, it's kind of uh, switched. But still, it shows very stylish uniqueness. Building. Uh, this would be very familiar because it's uh, in New York. Uh, it's a Hudson Hotel. Well, for me, it doesn't look like pretty much like hotel. It, it looks like uh, just, uh, just a random residence because you see the very antique furniture, chairs, fire, fireplace. And you see in the upper part, it, it has a bookshelves, which feels more like a private residence. And also, the color makes a more uh, antique to the uh, design. And, uh, so, um, and this is the his industrial parts. Well. Not like his interior design, the uh, industrial design is very simple and practical designs, but very sophisticated. Well, this is design called trunk. Uh, as you can see, it's just a simple table, not uh, putting like fancy designs on it. It's very practical. Yeah. Well, this is also just called ghost poster. So very simple bookshelves, uh, very geometrically shaped, but still very has a sophisticated design and sharp design. So this is my favorite, and uh, it's uh, called uh, Out In. Well, unlike the other one, it, it uses curves to show the depth in it, and it's, and it's very uh, sharp and very sophisticated. But still practical. So, like um, Philip Stark uses like different characteristic in different areas. I think that makes the Philip Stark very unique to the French design and even like 20th century's design. He brought uh, a lot of re revolution to the design. That's why I think I, I admire him. 